Welcome back into Midnight Suns. Let's do this. I think I'm going to have to restart this round. Draw these two. These Cretans can't hope to stop you. That's the twelve. Excellent work.
so many empty frames. Ooh, now that Wanda's back, I feel like the band is finally back together. Can't wait to get some one-on-one -on -one time with her. Miss that witch. Go easy on her, Robbie. She's been through a lot. It might be a while before things go back to normal again. Normal? Since when were we ever normal? But Nico is right. Wanda might not be as social as we would like her to be. I just want to make sure she knows that we love her and are happy to have her home. Maybe start slow with something familiar, like a movie night. Blade, you just read my mind. Wow, really? What am I thinking now? You must have a mind for it to be read, Robbie. I meant, let's have a watching party in Wanda's honor. I think she's really gonna like that. Small victories, Hunter, are always worth celebrating. Like an old friend coming to her senses, courtesy of one of our newest friends. I don't like to be touched. You do not miss a thing. This war feels very winnable to me, Hunter. That's thanks to you. Your mastery of the portals is incredible. You're pretty awesome yourself. It's really good to have Wanda back. The whole place felt like it was missing her signature Scarlet. Thanks for letting me tag along today. I feel better already. But man, fighting demon hordes is almost as exhausting as fighting Avengers. <sighs> I forgot how relaxing it is to just zone out and watch a good movie after a long day of battle. Well, you earned it, Wanda. You were a real asset out there today. Just glad I could be of assistance. So you want to join us? That sounds lovely. All right. Wanda, are those three women witches? They are. They do not seem like witches. That's because they don't know they have powers. Yet. And if they did, they would be wise to hide them. Reminds me of how all the witches tried to hide themselves in 17th century Salem. Times really haven't changed that much. If there is one thing I know for sure, it is that power frightens people. And when people get frightened, well, you know. You literally lived around the times of the Salem Witch Trials. I was a young child, but yes. Caretaker and Agatha were terrible. <sighs> Sometimes I just wished I was, you know, normal. Things would have been easier for me growing up. Easier in what way? Sounds like there is a story there. There's always a story, but this is movie night, not a therapy session. And I really don't know you that well. Fair enough. Besides, we should be paying attention to the movie. We're just getting to the good part. Are those witches actually charmed by that awful man? Well, he is the devil, sort of. Then why do they not just turn him into a toad or banish him? Because they're good witches, Hunter. Like I hope to be one day. Oops. We've been through a lot as a team, but we've come a long way. Sleep time. Turn is an auspicious omen.
I almost sent my astral form to cover more ground. That means you were trying to ghost me? I caution against speaking in modern vernacular as it rapidly evaporates from the pool of youthful lexicon. Then magic will say you are uncool. Ah, yes. <clears throat> Our last conversation afforded me valuable insight into my current state of being. Standing in a castle, I see. Kindled some of my own belief in myself. The Sorcerer Supreme is a role only one mortal in a generation can hold. Fancy titles impress the illusion of rank upon the world, but that's all it is. A name for one who understands much, and yet so little at the same time. I am merely a man with a very useful set of skills who worked to fill a niche. I will light a beacon every step of the way. The doubt never crossed my mind. You have my gratitude, Hunter. Perhaps the Sorcerer Supreme could conjure me up an ice cream cone? Due to Stark's contractual obligations, I can only offer Avengers-themed flavors. Yeah. Nobody needs the caloric marvel that is Hulka Hulka burning love. A single scoop is a meal unto itself. Hunter, no matter what the outcome of our struggle is, you have not given up on me. That is a bond that carries beyond words and worlds. Thank you for watching this episode, I'll see you next time.